<clears throat> hey everybody, welcome back to another Creo tutorial. Today we're going to go over another option in the gimmick tool, which I wasn't clear on before, and it's pretty neat. So this will be a pretty short video, but it'll be fun. So we're going to go to start gimmick. I'm going to let this update, because I have it on automatically. I don't think it, there will be any updates, um, because most things are linked to the Krita updates. But I like to have it checked because you never know. You never know what it can do. <laughs> um, so we're going to go into games and demos. So when I was looking at this, I didn't think this was actually like anything like a big deal. Like, oh, it's just like the visual, right? No, no, no. It is not. So these are actual games within Krita. And I didn't know that. So when... Uh, one of the programmers in my guild and server was like, no, you can actually play the game. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I didn't realize that. I, I just thought it was like, um, like a snapshot or something. So we're going to do Pac-Man because that's a fun game. So I'm going to hit, uh, was that apply? Yeah, hit apply. Don't hit okay because it won't do anything. And this pops up on my second monitor, but... I have Pac-Man open, so we're gonna see. Oh jeez, I got I got to move my keyboard. All right, we're gonna see if I can get this going and play some Pac-Man. Meaning, when I'm stressed or tired or I'm just really busy and I just need a break, I can say, okay, I'm gonna take a break drawing and play some freaking Pac-Man. Like, how awesome is that? That's pretty awesome to me. So, I'm probably gonna die here, but that's okay. Alright, level two, look at that! So, yeah, if you wanna play Pac Man. Ah, oh, shit. Oh man, I'm nervous now. <laughs> ah, okay, got it. Yes, level three. Got two lives left. I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. Oh shit. Oh, you ran away. Okay, sounds good to me. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh shit. Yeah, because... Oh yeah, the map does change. Damn, is this how Pac-Man always was? I actually don't remember. I don't know. What? Can I get it? Yes! Look at me go! Look at me! And I got one life left. Let's see. Hanoi Tower. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's... Okay, it's apply. Click and drag it. Oh wait, why are you doing that? Why are you yelling at me? Oh, I see. I have to... I did it! I don't think I won anything. Oh geez. 131 moves. I'm guessing the point is to do it in as little moves as possible, but I did it. That worked. That works. Alright, yeah, so if you are working hard and Krita, you just want to take a break um, and do something weird, I don't know. Oh, this is interesting. Welcome to Gimmick. A powerful image processing framework yes um you play some games there is tic-tac-toe there is tetris which i did play a little bit of um just classic tetris nothing nothing too crazy i know there's like new versions of not new versions but like um fancier more intense versions of tetris out now which look pretty cool but Classic Tetris is just fine. Why am I getting the same thing? So yeah, that's pretty much the one update I wanted to do for this because I thought it was pretty neat. I don't know, maybe you just want to try something different in Krita. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you had fun and learned something new. I hope you go try this out. 
because this is pretty neat. I thought it was worth um, doing an update on before I get into the nitty gritty of some other things um, that the filter can do. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on my next video. And I will see you in the next one.